and pray and listen, hear your father These lies they told are so familiar They will haunt you, they will kill you Keep you hostage, king will heal you Before him, adore him He will give you everything Come and take your Can't keep going more. back to what I used to Please hold my hand as I go down this road Can't keep going back to what I used to know But please hold my hand as I go down this road Can't keep going back Lies they told are so familiar They will haunt you, they will kill you Keep you hostage, king will heal you Before him, adore him He will give you everything Come and take your Can't keep going more. back To what I used to know Please hold my hand as I go down this road Can't keep going back to what I used to know But please hold my hand as I go down this road King will heal you before him, adore him. He will give you everything. Come and take your Can't keep going back. Girl loves talking about them fragrance. So we love talking about them fragrance. Yeah. Yeah, let's bring it in the brain. Hey, sexy crew. 15 minutes to get this natural beat full look. Oh, man, we go. I think I've got it easy. This is a travel vlog. I'm done, I'm not. I'm a pop star, I'm not a doctor. Again, and I'm not driving nothing, but I got to stick with keys in. Thank you. Okay. Welcome to Orlando. To what I used to Please hold my hand as I go down this road Can't keep going back to what I used to know But please hold my hand as I go down this road told are so familiar they will haunt you they will kill you keep you hostage king will heal you before him adore him he will give you everything come and take your Can't keep going more. back to what i used to know but please hold Keep 
Welcome back to Lakeisha Sexy 40 Plus channel. Thanks for clicking on my channel. As always, y'all already know, it's a vibe. It's a pleasure over here. I appreciate y'all. So, if this is your first time clicking on this channel, welcome to my channel. I feel like I'm bringing New York City realistic vibes, lifestyle realistic vibes over here. I do a little fashion. We do a little traveling and we are definitely in tune with the universe you heard sexy so if you enjoy lifestyle realistic and you want to get the new york city vibes make sure you stay tuned make sure you hit that red button and you join the sexy crew sexy and to my day ones y'all already know how i feel about y'all y'all know the vibes sexy so I'm starting this video right now because I was, I know y'all can see the background. I basically was going through my basket, this little basket right here. I have like a lot of different summer essentials and I'm like, let me start recording right now because I, got, I need to show my sexy crew the fashion. Like we love the vibes over here, like the fashion vibes. We love the fashion vibes over here, sexy. Unfortunately, I'm not able to show as much fashion as I would like because my daily life is really realistic, regular shit over here. So your girl's wearing sweatpants and jeans and t-shirts, like, you know, those are the vibes most of the time. However, when I can get into the fashion, I'm definitely ready to get into the fashion. My younger self, when I was going to college and I was um, working as a medical assistant, I was going to say, but I, I wore scrubs as a medical assistant. But when I was going to college and in my younger years, your girl wore nothing but shoes on her feet. That's all I wear. That's hence to probably why my knees is coming. But sexy, I was in the fashion, into the fashion very much so. Let me put a couple of flicks up for y'all right now. Just a couple, like to show y'all, like your girl was very much into the fit. And I was also a lot thinner. <laughs> I was also a lot thinner, sexy. But I thought it would be fun. New York City vibes, sexy. New York City vibes. I thought it would be fun to show y'all my basket full of summer essentials, full of things that I definitely know that I could get away with this summer. I can still look cute and fashionable. And most importantly, I won't be too damn hot because your girl be perspiring like crazy sexy. So there's a few things in my basket that I wanted to share with my sexy crew and a few summer dresses that I feel that is essential to the summertime. Like summer dresses, maxi dresses are definitely a uh, key to the summer sexy. So the reason for me actually doing this and I'm just sharing it here on my channel is because I'm looking for an outfit to wear to my son's graduation. So with that being said, I was like, let me share this with my sexy crew. I have a couple of options that I wanted to share with my sexy crew. And yeah, comment down below because you will be seeing this vlog before his graduation. So definitely comment down below which one y'all think I should wear. That would be really helpful. And by the way, sexy, I'm not gonna be uploading this vlog on Sunday because as y'all seen on the screen, today is Friday that I'm starting this vlog. I actually was supposed to start the vlog on Thursday, which was yesterday, because I wanted to show y'all the vibes because I'm getting ready. I'm like, it's so much, right? I'm getting ready for this Father's Day barbecue. 
So that's also content. So I'm like, let me start vlogging, which was Thursday. I was like, let me start vlogging so I could show my sexy crew, crew the vibes leading up to Friday. And then, of course, show y'all the Father Day vlog. However, I didn't, I didn't record yesterday. My cousin came, my cousin April, big shout out to my cousin April. She came and picked me up and we went around to different stores shopping for this barbecue. And I just like was caught up with my cousin and yeah, I wasn't being a, a great vlogger. However, I do have some items that I wanna show my sexy crew that I purchased for the gift bags to give to the fathers on Father's Day. I definitely want to show y'all that. I don't know if I'm going to have time to show y'all now or if that would be in the next clip because I do have a nail appointment. And while we want to the nail, this nail appointment, I'm wanting to go back into that store that say they going out of business. But every time I go in there, it seems like they bring it more and more into the store. <laughs> but I wanted to go check out the vibes because I... One of the jean skirt, um, I see that's in trend this season. So I wanted a jean skirt. I have two options for Father's Day that I'm gonna share with my, my sexy crew. Two options that I'm I'm thinking about wearing, but then I just have this jean skirt in my head. So while we head off to get my nails done, I'm going to stop into that store first before getting my nails done, if I can make it out the house in time, because I'm trying to show y'all the essential summer items, and then I gotta head out to my appointment. And if I get a chance to go to the store before, I would like to go to the store before my appointment. Oh. So with that being said, sexy, um, yeah, with that being said, sexy, let me show y'all the essential key item that's needed for this summer 2024. Okay, sexy. Let me put you up a little bit. Okay, sexy. So, y'all already seen my little basket I have. But I was going through my basket and I was trying to find a top to wear today to go get my nails done and run other little errands I have to run regarding the barbecue. So I said, let me share with y'all. So I have a lot of different tank tops here, body suits, body suits from Skims. And if y'all notice, my colors are like giving neutral. All the colors are giving very much neutral, white, creams, grays, like all my essentials. But I believe tank tops and body suits, a tank top is essential for the, for this heat. For the summer heat, a tank top is definitely essential. And you can throw it on basically with anything. Like right now, I just have one is black flare. It's flared at the bottom skirt very airy it just so happened to be black because y'all know your girl loves the black vibes over here however tank tops as such to throw on with something like the skirt or some jean shorts very much so a vibe these tank tops comes in clutch sexy and i, I purchased these from team you and when I say they are very much given lightweight, the material is fire. The material is fire, sexy. I love, love, love the material. It is so, so comfortable and thin. Then I wish I, let me see if I could get another one. The exact, yep. This is the exact same tank. It's just in a cream color. And I don't know if y'all can see, but like you can see right through this material. So, so comfortable for this summer heat, sexy. I love tank tops as such. And like I said, I throw it on with any and everything, sexy. 
pair of jeans because it depends on what I'm doing in the summer. I would still wear a pair of jeans, just some thin jeans. They do have summer jeans. So I would just, you know, pair it with some thin jeans and a little tank. And I also have this other tank and it's crisscross in the back. This one is just giving t-shirt tank vibes. But this one is crisscross in the back. It's giving sexy vibes. It's definitely giving sexy vibes, sexy. And I do love me a bodysuit, girl. Your girl would just throw on a bodysuit with a pair of jean shorts. Yes, I will. But, so, y'all know I'm self-conscious about my side rolls here. So, this is what I'll do with a tank top. If I decide to wear a tank top and I don't feel, I'm feeling a little insecure that day. Because there's times I don't care. The roles the rolls can hang. They can do what they do. But then it's times that I feel a little self-conscious. So, this is what I do with sexy. I would throw something like this on this jean vest. I'm trying to remember where I purchased this vest from. I think I got it from Team U. I believe I got it from Timu, but I would definitely add this to the fit sexy when I'm feeling a little insecure. Like I said, it's times I don't care, but then it's times that, you know, I want to cover up a little bit. New York vibe, sexy. I apologize. So, yeah, sexy. Like, I have me a, a few vests. Something I'm about to show y'all to go with one of the summer dresses I'm thinking of wearing to my son's graduation. Let me show y'all. But this is a cute fit, right? This would be a cute fit. I could even wear it with some sneakers. I could wear it with some sandals. I just recently purchased some dad sandals this would be perfect this would be perfect a whole vibe a whole vibe sexy and by the way sexy i know y'all noticed that i took the braids out my hair washed my hair and yeah we're gonna rock this barn for a week maybe two yeah let me show y'all the dresses so I was trying to make sure y'all can't get a peek out the mirror back there. So sexy. I'm undecided if I want to wear this summer dress or um, another one I have here that I'm going to show my sexy. Oh, it hides perfectly under the dress. Okay. Let me give you a closer look. So sexy. I'm gonna try to see all the vibes. Okay, y'all can see the vibes, right? So I don't know if I'm going to wear this one. This yellow and black maxi dress goes all the way down to my ankle, which I love that about a maxi dress. I love it to hit the bottom of my feet. I love it to hit right up, right to the bottom of my ankle. So I feel like this is a vibe, sexy. It's a cute vibe. I love it. But I'm still indecisive about which one I want to wear. And then... I was thinking of pairing it with this little blazer jacket. Just to cover up a little. 
But I think that yeah, I think that would be so many colors. Please let me know down in the comments below, sexy. Do y'all think this would be so many colors? Would this be so many colors, sexy, or would this work perfect? And for my feet, I can wear my black dad sandals or nah, the white ones, nah. Nah, I, I should wear, if I do wear, yeah, if I pick this, I should wear my black dad, dad sandals with this. But is the jacket clashing or is it meshing well? Please comment down below, sexy, and let me know. So this is outfit number one. I have two different options that I'm thinking about for the graduation. So this is option number one. Let's switch out and I'm going to show y'all option number two. Okay, sexy, so let me step back so y'all can get a full view in the mirror. So this is a two-piece that I purchased from Shein, I think last year. Never wore, wore it. It has pockets on the side of the skirt, as you can see. It's given like a soft cotton material, but not thin. Is given thick to wear, like it holds you in. It gives you like a nice hold. And the color is a vibe. The color is mint. This mint green is a vibe. And I will pair it with this army green vest. Again, just to like hide a little, just a little. And yeah. I think it's cute. I would th definitely throw on some white sandals. I have two different white sandal options. I definitely can wear with this look if I decide to wear this look. But this is option number two, sexy. I need y'all help. Y'all gotta comment down below and let me know which one y'all think I should wear to the graduation. I have one more option. I lied when I said two. I have one more option to show my sexy crew to see what we're gonna wear for the son's graduation. So, and I'm kind of moving a little fast. I apologize, because I do have to make it out for my appointment, but I wanted to show my sexy crew the fashion essentials for 2024. And I needed y'all help. I mean, I, I need y'all to help me decide what I'm gonna wear for my son's graduation. So let me put on the last option. Sexy, we have another maxi dress option. So this dress is not going all the way down to my ankle. It's like two inches above my ankle. Yeah, about two inches above my ankle I prefer it to hit the bottom of my ankle but the color is giving a summer vibe it do have pockets I really don't particularly like pockets in my summer maxi dresses however this is something that I definitely will wear on vacation so I wouldn't even wear this for my son's graduation so we're gonna just stay with the first two options. I already know I'm exempting this one. Yeah, we're not gonna wear this one to the graduation. However, it's a cute dress. It's a cute 
summer, I feel like it's giving vacation vibes. I definitely feel like it's giving vacation vibes, vacation vibes sexy. And I'm a little disappointed that it's not hitting the bottom of my ankle. Other than that, the material is a soft, like, silky vibe. And I'm kind of wondering, like, would that make me hot? Because it is giving, like, a silky material. But the colors is vibrant summer vibes. I love it. And by the way, sexy, I smell fucking amazing. You heard? I smell so good. I'm taking off these um, dresses on and off. And I'm like smelling myself. Whole vibe. Whole vibe. Smell amazing. That Burberry Brit. Great summer fragrance. But yeah, sexy. We exempt in this one. So let me know how y'all feel about option number one and option number two. And when I come back, when we get back, I should say, because I'm taking y'all with me. But when we get back, I have to show y'all the goodie bags for Father's Day. So, yeah, sexy. Make sure you get your lemon water, your wine, your tequila. I don't know what time of day you might be watching this. But get ready, because we're about to have a fun, fun vlog, sexy. Okay, sexy. This is the outfit for the day. Uh, basically, we put back on that black skirt with this black shirt it says black blessed and beautiful y'all already know the vibes i have one of these duke earrings i have on my watch y'all seen me crimp my hair this morning y'all seen the scent of the day which is this burberry brick but wait sexy i ain't even get outside yet sexy and i'm sweating and that's because it's, the humidity is up. It's about to be like summer vibes for real. And I had to turn my AC off so it won't be drowning y'all out. I only did my eyebrows today. That's it. But sexy, while I continue to get ready because I'm kind of like in a rush, let me tell y'all real quick. Y'all see the empty vibes? So this is the uh, Brazilian crush in the number 68 sexy. I love as y'all can see it's over and as y'all can see this Burberry brick I tore this shit up last summer you heard me I tore this fragrance up last summer sexy and I think I'm about to finish it out this summer most likely because I I purchased this last summer yeah I purchased this last summer and went through it went through it a whole summer sweet vibe and the number 68 in a Brazilian crush that I'm about to have to throw away let's see if we get the last drop nah it's a wrap there's nothing else coming out of this so I'm gonna throw on my accessories I'm choosing to wear my L I purchased this in um, Florida in North Miami, this L, y'all already know my favorite chain my grandbaby gave me. You know, my rings, my thumb ring, my engagement ring. Ah, my other ring fell. And I'm also going to put on my ring that my nails broke, but. And then I'm going to put on my anklet. Sexy. I purchased these from BJ's yesterday. They had a six a six pack of Adidas socks. Really, really cute Adidas socks. And y'all yeah, know I'm always wearing the Yeezy foams. Especially to run my errands. So I had to cop the Adidas ankle socks pretty pretty summer colors summer vibes so if you're in bj's make sure y'all got a look because y'all already and it was affordable i forget how much what was it 11.99 for six of them or 12.99 something something like that 
I'm so hot, sexy. I was working and the immunity is going. So yeah, I'm gonna throw in these socks, throw on my phones, and we're gonna head out because I definitely wanna go to the store before my appointment to check out. I just wanna see if they have some um some jean skirts. And then I'm gonna get my nails done and Oh, you were hot. We'll probably run over to the dollar store to see if I should get anything else to add to the dad bags that's right there for Father's Day. I really was thinking I should get some shots, some tequila shots to add to the dad bag. But the things that I already got is like giving beauty, health, and wellness. So, if I was to purchase the shots and the shot glasses, it's like, would it go? It kind of would, right? We think about it because what I got, y'all don't know what I got yet, but what I got is like giving health, wellness, beauty vibes because men could be sexy too. However, throwing the shot glass and the shots inside the bag is giving like nighttime vibes, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. We gonna see. And then again, I'm gonna show my sister group what I did purchase already and if I add something or not, you know? But let's be out, Sexy, come on. Sexy is so beautiful out here. Next week, the humidity is gonna peak in and it ain't gonna be it's beautiful <laughs> it's gonna be hot but it feels really really nice right now it's not too hot the sun is shining yeah it's a whole vibe i'm feeling the weather right now i'm feeling comfortable i'm smelling amazing yeah sexy let me see where this uber is at and no, I can't do a power walk to go get my nails done. It's too far. <laughs> God, you call me by my name. The love you give me, I just can't deny. Yeah. No longer blinded, I can see you. I'm on my way to meet you. Tries and tribulations got me tired, I need rest And I heard that I can come to you when weary of my flesh You awaken me from death, God I need you No more walking by the flesh, that's when I leave you God told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone Told me I'm someone, told me I'm, told me I'm Told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone Know that I'm someone no, I'm a child of God I wanna go to Godly way Close to your love again I give my heart again. I wanna go to Godly way Close to your love again I give my heart again You know me well I feel invisible until you tell me you're right here I cancel plans with you to be with sin and break your heart Sometimes I go to you for what you give, not who you are I wonder if you'll leave for me God, just tell me what you need for me Is the Holy Spirit silly me? God, I'm asking you for clarity Even though you told me already Hey, sexy. So I have a few minutes. So we're gonna go inside the store that's going out of business. <laughs> I bet you they got more stuff in here. Let me show y'all the sign where it says store closing. It been saying this for about what a good three months now. I think it's been about a good three months. It been saying this. Let's see. Look, everything must go store closing. Oh, it's saying now last day June, June 30th. Let's see.
Cause you call me by my name The love you give me I just can't deny No longer blinded I can feel I'm on my way to meet you We gotta talk Tries and tribulations got me tired, I need rest And I heard that I can come to you and weary of my flesh You awake me from death, God I need you No more walking by the flesh, that's when I leave you God told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone Told me I'm someone, told me I'm, told me I'm Told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone Know that I'm someone no, I'm a child of God I wanna go to Godly way Close to your love again I give my heart again. I wanna go to Godly way Close to your love again I give my heart again You know me well I feel invisible until you tell me you're right here I cancel plans with you to be with sin and break your heart Sometimes I go to you for what you give, not who you are I wonder if you'll leave for me God, just tell me what you need for me Is the Holy Spirit still in me? God, I'm asking you for clarity Okay, sexy. God told me I got this fun something. Some cute goodies, actually. Now I'm here in Popeye's. I'm gonna get me something to drink to go sit in a nail salon with. Hi. Hi. Can I have a strawberry lemonade, please? A small? Fro frozen, please. Yeah. Do you have wings? Spicy. Okay, you can choose uh, these flavors. We sell it like six or twelve pieces. Okay. Um, I'll take six pieces and let me try the ghost pepper. Okay. Don't you have? Is the yeah? I'm gonna do the ghost pepper. The ghost pepper is just the plain uh, wings. It doesn't have any sauce on top of it. No sauce. I was not supposed to be buying nothing. I bought a cute, cute, cute dress, sexy. I can't wait to show my sexy group. I'm supposed to be um picking up my most uh, sweatsuit. I'm getting for Father's Day this Sergio. I'll put it on the screen. He wants this sweatsuit, so and it's a little pricey. So um yeah, I'm gonna get him this sweatsuit for Father's Day. And I did pick up like some knickknacks out of the store when I went shopping with my cousin yesterday. I picked up a few knickknacks to put in a bag for my grandson to give to him for Father's Day. Yeah. But I can't wait to get in the house and show my sexy crew the fashion vibes. Like I found a really, really cute dress. Really, really cute, sexy. And I don't have any business eating Popeyes, but I figured um, I only had a fruit cup, which I seen in the B-roll footage earlier in this, in this vlog. I only had a fruit cup, so I'm hungry and I'm about to go sit in a nail salon for at least two hours because, girl, I'm about to get my nails cut. We about to go short. We about to go short. Um, I don't have no time for my nails to keep breaking, so I'm gonna go short for the summer. And let me show y'all the inspiration of what I'm going for today. Very, very simple, the black and white vibes, but that's definitely what I'm going for this this set that I'm about to get. And yeah, don't forget we going short. Is it ready? My drink is ready. Yes, thank you. Yes, thank and you. And I gave you one branch inside. Thank you so much. No, I'm fine. Thank you. You too. I have a few doors to go. So I'm going to sit on my frozen strawberry lemonade. 
We gotta get the straw out. Put my ghost pepper wings in my bag. Hopefully, she's not ready, so I can eat my my ghost pepper wings. But if she's ready, it looks like I'm just gonna be sipping on this. So way sexy. I got two compliments already. When I got in the Uber, <laughs> I was telling the Uber so I was like, ooh, it smells so good in here. So he was like, thank you. He was like, you smell good. <laughs> I was like, thank you. Um, then when I went in the store just now, the store that's went out of business, <laughs> the uh, guy was like, when, I, when it was time for me to pay for my items, he was, he wrapped my shirt to me. He was like, you are definitely less than beautiful. I was like, thank you. But I thought it was too funny. How do you even say the black? He just was like, you are definitely less than beautiful. I was in tears, sexy. I just want to show, I just want to share that with y'all. In tears. And we walk to the nail salon now. Done with my nails. I showed y'all the inspiration. And yeah, I basically got the same thing, but just a different shape. Y'all know I like my square shape. And then I do the pointy, the pointy pinky. Now we off to, so I'm conflicted, right? Uh, I think I should just order this sweatsuit. That's another story. But right now, I'm gonna walk to the beauty store and I'm gonna check inside this $1.25 store because yesterday when I went out with my cousin, we went to BJ's, we went to a lot of stores. But one of the stores we went to was the $1.25 store, but just a different location. So since I'm in the area, I figured I'll check this style 25 store to see if I wanted to add anything to the gift bags for the dads that I'm going to show y'all when I get in the house. So that's what we go to now, Sexy Boo. The beauty supply store and and also um, the beauty supply store Oh, and a dollar twenty-five store. Why they have? Why they got candles for ten ninety-five? But it says a select few. I'm gonna keep walking because I have enough candles. Oh, this two piece is cute. I see the um, blue two piece. I love the color blue. Fun fact, my favorite color. Blue, black, gray. Yeah, basic vibes. <laughs> we all sexy blue. I still, I'm still sipping on my strawberry lemonade and 
I have not eaten my chicken. sweating I had bags in my hand so the other two stores that I went into I didn't even bother to pick up the camera because my hands were full really full so um the stuff I got from the grocery store isn't that fun I just basically got some stuff uh for the barbecue for the Father's Day barbecue and box of ziti I got some baked beans, the vegetarian beans, because if you don't know, it don't have any pork in them. I got some onions, some yellow onions, and then I got some kebab sticks for the shrimp and chicken kebabs. I got some Alfredo sauce to make my rasta pasta. Peppers and a box of this Goya salad and vegetable seasoning. If you never tried this sexy brew, try it on your vegetables. It hypes and amps the veggie the veggies up. I'm telling y'all, hypes the flavor up, sexy. So now, sexy, we gonna go in my room and I'm gonna show y'all. The cute little items I got from the store that's going out the out of business. I also got some cleaning supplies. Y'all don't really want to see that either. <laughs> or do y'all? Look, or do y'all? I like to see what cleaning supplies my girlies be using. You always give me different ideas, but. I got my boys some deodorant. I got some Advil liquid gel. I picked up this Dove in a cucumber scent. I got some Dawn. Some more toothpaste. I got the baking soda and peroxide whitening toothpaste. Oh, so I picked up this Nair, this body cream hair remover for my underarms, for my legs, because the shaving be leaving me like the hair bumps. I don't like that. I don't like that. So we're going to try the Nair. I know this is what my mama used to use back in the days, the Nair. So I picked up some Nair and it has rich cocoa butter plus vitamin E. So I will be using that tomorrow morning. I also picked up some Lysol with bleach. I picked up Ajax. And I got me some Listerine. The original Listerine is the best sexy. Okay, sexy, I'm cooled off a little bit. It's about an hour later, maybe 45 minutes later from when I showed y'all the little groceries that I had to add on to 
the preparation for the Father's Day barbecue. But I also want to show my sexy crew what I got today. So I'm trying to figure out what I should start with. Because I want to try the stuff on that I bought from, um, what is it called? Baby Blue from a store that's going out of business. Uh, let's start with the stuff I got from the dollar store. Or let's start with the stuff I got from the beauty store. The beauty supply store. Because I went inside the beauty supply store. As y'all seen. And y'all see me looking at the head bands. So... Oh, I'm like, where did I put them? So, when I went inside the beauty supply store, I just picked up these headbands. I love the detailing on this one. And I just got something just to go around my, my head. When I don't feel like giving myself a bun, and I just want to... <laughs> Throw on my sweatpants and my t-shirt and run out, but still want to look put together. I needed a couple of these because my sewing is still like the hair is amazing. I'm not gonna lie. This hair is from Timu. I do have it linked in the description box if you are interested. These bundles are from Timu and they are lit. Like the last time when I was living in the hotel, I kept that sewing, I kept that sewing in. For about six weeks sexy so and that was just me you know wanting a fresh hairstyle because i could actually left it in longer but yeah sexy i picked these up just for when i don't feel like doing the front of my hair and i could just throw these on and like i said my sewing is still looking fresh and i'll still look put together and it was it wasn't that much i think it was 4.99 3.99 i forget it was something like that like 3.99 and i just got a regular black one because y'all know black goes with everything also i picked up remember when i was telling y'all about the adidas socks when i was getting dressed earlier today i had got the ankle adidas socks so i went back just now and got the long ones as well and they come in great summer colors they give you two white but however <coughs> it's two pair white but the adidas sign has the blue and then on the other white pair the adidas sign has the pink and as you can see the pink ones has the white Adidas signs. I think this is so cute. And then the blue, the pretty, pretty blue, is giving the white Adidas sign. I love. And what colors would a gray have one? So the gray just have the white Adidas sign on it. But I got these because I wear my Yeezy phones a lot. And I noticed with the phones in the slides, your feet get so ashy at the bottom. And I don't like the look. It be looking like I need to lotion my feet throughout the day when I just wear my Yeezys without socks. So I needed the short ones, of course, for the summer. However, there's looks that I be wanting to wear with the longer socks. So I'm like, why didn't I get the short ones and the long ones yesterday when I purchased the short ones? Let me give y'all a peek at the short ones. Same vibe same vibe sexy it comes in the same exact color as the longer ones they are just ankle socks but they come in the same exact colors just you just got the anklet and then you got the long and yesterday when i went out shopping with my cousin i just picked up the short i'm like no 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 keys you should have got both of them and luckily when i went back today they had the long one still. So, yeah, sexy. A vibe. Like, when I want to wear my Yeezy phones or my Yeezy slides or my Yeezy runners, my sneakers, like, I can wear these now. We're putting on my Nike socks with my Yeezys. Well, you know, Yeezys is made by Adidas. But anyway, sexy. Um, Let's talk about the gift bags. 
that I want to give to the fathers for Father's Day. So not all fathers are going to get a bag. Everybody that's going to be there is not going to get a bag. We basically going to do like a tribute to certain dads that's going to be there. So, oh, I got my son a graduation card because y'all know he's graduating. So it says, and it's pretty, it's gold, giving gold and black. It's pretty. Son, as you graduate, there are so many things that are being wished for you. Oh my gosh, these words are little. <laughs> I need my glasses for this one. Um, you wish a world of adventure and experience. You are wish strength and confidence satisfaction and joy in all that you pursue and this the greatest wish that you'll always remember what a special person you are and how fortunate the world is to have you in it i thought it was beautiful i thought it was a beautiful card so of course i'm gonna put a little coin in the card and i'm gonna give him that for graduation so when I went to the dollar store today, I just picked up some tissue paper because I didn't get any yesterday for the bags that I want to give away. But I also picked up the certificates of achievement. So my man, Hamo, he actually suggested last night when he seen my bag, which is this bag right here, he seen it sitting there and he's like, what's that? I'm like, oh, that's just the gift bags I want to give to certain for certain dads to show the appreciation of them being a great dad not that everyone that's there is not a you know a great dad however i don't i'm not gonna know i don't know everyone personally that's gonna be there like no long story short it's gonna be other guys there and dads there but i just thought it would be cute to do like a tribute to certain guys, you know how you go to the award shows and everybody are amazing artists. However, not everybody can win the award, right? So that's what this is giving. So I picked up the certificates of achievement. It says this certificate is proudly presented to, and we're gonna put their names. And then it says given and and which will be June on the day of, which will be the 16th, and the year, which will be 2024. And yeah, and then it has a signature you can sign it. But I thought that would be really, 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 really cute. And it says four right here. So of course we're gonna say something like being a great dad, you know, something to that nature. So that's what I picked up today. And like I said, the tissue paper. So yesterday, let me bring y'all down so y'all can see when I plop the bag after I move this. I really want to try this mirror. Like I said, I used to see my mom use this a lot, but I never did it. I always just shaved my legs, but we're going to try it. So let me bring y'all down just a little just so y'all can see me bringing Y'all can see me bringing this stuff out. So yesterday, while we shopped, my cousin and I, oh, I just got this for Hamo to throw in his bag. He's always looking for a beard comb and some scissors. So I just seen it and snatched it up. And it is a barber, it's a barber scissor comb set, professional kit. Yeah. Um. I picked up three of army green bags, three of the navy blue bags. So y'all see, we just given it to like six guys, <laughs> six guys. So let me, okay, let's start off with the socks. So my cousin and I picked up a few socks. I noticed the guys like the character socks and 
things of that nature in the summer with their shorts. So we picked up some socks. Oh, one more. I got six. So, yeah. Yeah, I thought this would be something useful that the dads can use. So, we picked up some cute socks. Y'all know I have to get all things broody, smell good, something. And the men are sexy, too. Don't forget sexy. The men are sexy, too. So, I got them some Dove Men Care uh, Face and Hand and Body Hydra. Huh? Ultra Hydro Cream. And yes, I got six of these as well. I got six of these as well, sexy. So the cute. The cutest thing that we did purchase are these mugs. So we picked up some coffee mugs, tea mugs, whatever the dad like to drink. And we got three of the same ones, which say the adventure begins with dad. We got three of the blue. The blue is just giving a vibe. Y'all know, you know, I'm kind of biased because I love the color blue. And then we got two of the same ones. Best that ever. I thought that would be cute. And then we have this one that says best that by par. Yeah. So. So, yes, sexy. Those are the gift bag vibes. I think it's cute. I think it's cute. I also picked up this beauty blender from the Dollar 25 store. Sometimes I like to get, like, get in the corner of my eyes with a, a beauty blender. And the beauty blenders that I have are dirty. And it seemed like when I wash them, I guess because the makeup stained them, I'm like really feeling like they still not clean. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, sexy. Um, I think the bags are gonna be cute. It's gonna be cute, and I guess the certificates will like amp it up, like they are being rewarded for something. So, yeah, I'm gonna hook these party bags. Well, these tribute bags. I'm gonna hook these tribute bags up, but not before I try one of the items and show y'all the items that. I purchased from Baby Blue, the store that's going out of business. I have my water with me. Do y'all throw all y'all receipts in y'all bags as y'all moving? My straw, um, the, the papers in my straw, I like always throw that stuff in the bag so when I get home, I can just throw it in the garbage. But I found the jean skirt, sexy. I seen the jean skirt the last time I went in there. But I was just like indecisive about the skirt because of the little cuts and such. But when I looked again today, I'm like, I hope it fit. We're going to try it on. We're going to try it on. I hope it fits. And I also couldn't leave this. I just thought it was so cute. Sexy. It is a short dress. It's not a maxi. It comes like a little past my knee. I'm, yeah, I believe it should come. Like, yes, yeah, definitely gonna come past my knee. But the color, do y'all see the color? We about to try this on. Because the um little dressing room they had in there was just basically like a curtain in the corner. I'm like, I'm not trying nothing on in here. Like if I had somebody with me, if I have someone with me, then I probably would have, but I don't got nobody with me. I'm not trying that stuff on. But I could always, I always give stuff away anyway, like re-gift it because 
Should I say me gifted? Yeah, because I, I can buy myself a gift. Yeah, yeah. So I always give it away. Like if it's too small or too big, I was just giving to a friend, my mom, family member, my, my cousin. You know, I don't never really, I really return items. It got to be pricey, pricey, pricey for me to return that item, to be honest. But let's try on this skirt and this dress, sexy. Let's see the vibes. Because I might be wearing this blue dress to the graduation because it is so cute with my light blue vase, um, my light blue blazer jacket. So sexy. I just basically put my scarf around my edges because I know my man, it's Friday. My man gonna come in here and tell my dad, hey, let's go here, let's go there. So I said, let me lay my hair down. <laughs> so just in case he do say that, I will be ready. All right, let me show y'all something. This is the jean skirt that I wanted. I like it. It's cute, and it's a um extra large. I was kind of scared it wouldn't fit, but it fit nice. It fits nice. It's actually cute. It's the pocket. That's probably gonna be annoying the pocket sticking out. But I like it. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. I think it's really, really cute. And it comes just to my knee. It comes right, it's laying like right on my knee. Right now, I like, and this was um sixteen dollars. This skirt was sixteen dollars. I think it's really cute. This is a cute dress, sexy. See, things like this is what I was speaking about earlier. Essential summer items like you need to stay in your wardrobe. And this is definitely one of them. This was $19.99. The color is a vibe. I already let y'all know a thousand times in this vlog. My favorite color is blue. So... It's a vibe, but it's giving like a denim blue, sexy. If y'all can see, it's giving a denim blue. I love the flowiness, the airiness to it. I actually love the detailing of the buttons. I like the squinch right here. You know, it gives it a little style. And it is thin. Is thin. I definitely would wear boy shorts under because it's it's really really thin. I'm looking in the mirror and I can see through the dress. But we want thin. That 90 degree weather and that humidity, we want thin. We want airy, you know? So it's a vibe, it's a statement, it's a keeper, something I will be wearing this summer. I don't know if I should wear it for my son's graduation. So sexy, this is gonna be option number three. I want y'all to let me know. Remember the first two outfits I tried doing before I went and got my nails done? Um, This is gonna be option number three. Comment down below 
and let me know which one I should wear because this is coming out on Wednesday. My son's graduation is after that. So yeah, sexy. Let me know option one, option two, or option three. keep thinking too much about it like i feel like it's the thought that count i feel like the colors is given and yeah let me show y'all a peek inside which is not much it's not much y'all can really see because i did put the tissue paper but i showed y'all the items that i placed inside of the bag so i'm gonna let my cousin pick Cause I have three that I definitely want to give a gift bag and a certificate to. And I'm going to talk to my cousin April about the other three. Cause she might have people in particular that she might want to give a tribute to. So yeah, sexy. These are the dad bags. Very, very, very cost efficient. Like the dollar 25 store of, uh, the dollar twenty-five store is great for different occasions, parties. You could grab some cute, cute things there. But yeah, sexy. But yeah, sexy. Um, I think I'm not gonna record anymore for today. I'm gonna start recording again tomorrow when I head back out to pick up some more last-minute things for Father's Day and. Of course, I'm going to record Father's Day because that's going to be a whole vibe. But I think this is going to be the last clip for today, Friday. If I get into anything special, special, I'll start recording again. But most likely, I'm going to see my sexy crew tomorrow. Oh, my nails, right, sexy? I ain't give y'all a full look at my nails. But like I said... The inspiration picture I showed y'all, same vibes. I just got the square shape and the inspiration picture. The young lady has um, the pointy. 
but yeah, black and white vibes. And I have an appointment a whole month away. So it's going to be black and white vibes for a whole month. I'll see y'all tomorrow, sexy. Sexy. I know I told my sexy crew in the last clip, I'll see y'all tomorrow. But it's the same day. It's about maybe 30 minutes later, right? Why my man, my man, my man, he sends me a TikTok. What you do periodically, he finds something funny, he'll send me a TikTok, right? Sexy. I'm like, what you trying to say? So what you trying to say? Let me just share the TikTok with my sexy crew and then we can come back and talk about it. Let me show y'all the TikTok he sent me. Like, what are you trying to say? Sexy, what are you trying to say? Uh, for said, Father's Day. We yeah. said so socks is on the list. That's one. Anything that says best dad ever. Look, I know it's going to put some t-shirt and hat people out of business, but yeah. that best dad, number one dad. <laughs> Keep that where it's all that, Stop buying that stuff, bro. Keep that where it's Unless, Okay, situational. If this is my first child, baby a couple months old, I'm on my first Father's Day. Okay. That might be cool. No tools. Lace Unless no tools. you're a carpenter. Right. <laughs> Or you got a hobby right. that you like to build stuff on uh -huh. the side, then buy tools. Don't buy me no tie. No ties. Definitely don't need no ties. Don't buy me no, ties. no mugs. No. Random gadgets. I don't want no gadget. That's a five. banana slicer or nothing <laughs> like that. <laughs> uh, egg separator. I don't want nothing like that. Cargo shorts. Cargo shorts. Wait, who bought you some cargo no, shorts? That's, when this come out, it's going to be close to Father's Day. Look at all the stores, all the sales. All the sales for clothing somewhere in there is gonna be carpenter shorts. No that. soaps. No. Yeah, no, I don't need no, no, no. no don't give me no bourbon oh, soap. Right. No. <laughs> no dad joke books. I don't want nothing. No dad, dad joke books. <laughs> nothing handmade. I don't want no handmade. He trying to be funny. <laughs> so wait, he always say like fathers get socks and. Um, tools and things of that nature. So remember, sexy. I just showed y'all the gift bag, right? <laughs> I just showed y'all the gift bag. So I'm like, what are they trying to say? What are y'all trying to say? It's the thought that count. I would love a goodie bag with different beauty pop products inside the gift bag. Like, what are y'all trying to say? I got mug, I got socks, I got a couple of things the guy just was talking about in that TikTok, and I'm feeling a certain type of way. What are y'all trying to say? I believe that just goes for like the wife, the girlfriend, the spouse, gifting. I don't feel like that goes for the gift bag. I feel like the gift bag is like just a nice gesture at the barbecue right right sexy comment down below if y'all feeling my vibes if y'all know what i'm talking about you know sexy i just had to share that because i just finished showing y'all the gift bags so for him to send me that tiktok i was like <laughs> i can't i can't i can't I would just say this. I hope they appreciate their give backs and their acknowledgement for being a great dad because that's just what it's all about. It's not about the material things. It's about the thought. So I'm going to leave it there and I'm going to see my sexy crew tomorrow. <laughs>
I had things cooking. I was chopping up onions. I was just getting started. That clip was about 10 something this morning. It is now 7.45 in the evening. I know y'all seen the date already, June the 15th, 2024. And your girl been in the kitchen all day. <laughs> been in the kitchen all day sexy. Y'all see the vibes? <laughs> I know y'all see the vibes. I know my sexy crew see the vibes, sexy. So, yeah, I've been working all day. I done made, let me, matter of fact, let me just show y'all what I prepared today. All that I did today, starting with cleaning, cleaning and seasoning meats, which I had to clean and season the chicken legs. I had to clean and season the steak. I had to clean and season the lamb. I had to clean and season the chicken breast. Sexy. I was cleaning and seasoning all day. So, so sexy. Um, yeah, I, I did the meats and then I prepared all the sides. All, every last side except the peas and rice. Hamo, my man, my man, my man, he made the peas and rice. But I made chicken rasta pasta. I made ziti. I made baked beans. I made mac macaroni salad. I made rasta pasta. That's all the sides that I made. And all the meats obviously gonna go on the grill. But yeah, so let me show y'all. Let me just let me give, give y'all a little peek. So I got like chicken season on this side, chicken season on this side. It's some jerk chicken season. It's some barbecue chicken that's seasoned. Then we have the lamb. And what I'm about to get to now, I got chicken all back there, if you can see. What I'm about to get to now is this meat right here. We're about to do these burgers. <clears throat> Yeah, sexy. We're about to get to them burgers. I do have frozen burgers. I also have frozen burgers, but I always like to do my own burgers at barbecues. I like to do season and put the onions and, you know, do the works. So I always have frozen burgers and I also have beef, my own beef burgers as well. So, yeah, sexy. I'm gonna get to work with seasoning up this meat right here. One hundred percent pure ground beef. We're gonna get the seasoning this bad boy up, pattying them up. Yeah, and I'm done for the um. Well, I should be right. I'm done for the evening as far as working in the kitchen. I really didn't get to enjoy my Saturday, but I will have some fun tomorrow. Um, yeah, but when I finish with this, I have to go work. I have to go edit because I'm feeling a certain type of way already that I can't upload a video tomorrow, which y'all know my uploading days are Sundays and Wednesdays. So I'm already feeling a certain type of way that I can't upload on Sunday, which is Father's Day. But I will be dropping this vlog on Wednesday, so I have to stay diligent in my work to make sure I'm able to get it up to y'all on Wednesday. Because there's a lot that comes with, after recording, there's a lot of other work that comes after that. It's not just uploading the videos to YouTube, there's a lot of other things that come with that. And I also started getting into the editing, and yeah, you know, I have to work if I want the video to look decent. I'm already recording off my iPhone, which I feel like is not the best quality. It's okay, the iPhone, I'm not gonna front. It be doing its thing. However, I be wanting to like incorporate B-roll of New York City vibes and just make the video a little more fun to watch. You know what I'm saying? 
But I'm gonna stop talking to my sexy crew so I can get to this meat. Let me show y'all everything I did prepare. I know, I know, y'all probably want a, a visual of what I made, right? Let me show y'all. Sexy crew. I also made mac macaroni salad. It's in my fridge, and I don't really feel like going all the way <laughs> and digging it out. But I made a bomb macaroni salad. You know, after you cook something, prepare something. I always take a little bit and put it on a little plate and taste to make sure I got enough onions, enough peppers, you know. Y'all know the vibes. But let me show y'all what I prepared. So sexy. This is the chicken rasta pasta that I made. And I did make two of them. Chicken rasta pasta. And over here, I have the ziti. This is baked ziti made with turkey. Here, I got baked beans made with onions, baked beans with onions. And I also have a black eyed pea, a yellow, a black eyed pea, yellow rice. And I also have two, I made two pans of this. And I also made two pans of the ziti. And then I have the string beans with the turkey meat. I don't know if y'all can see the meat. Yeah, y'all can see the meat. So, string beans, turkey meat, black eyed peas, yellow rice, baked beans with onions, and ziti. Also, also, y'all know I got the macaroni salad in the fridge, like I mentioned. And then we got the rasta pasta, the chicken rasta pasta, and all the protein. All the protein, sexy. Um, like I mentioned just now, we got the, um, we have the, um, jerk chicken, barbecue chicken, um, lamb, steak, we have chicken kebabs, um, uh, franks, and, oh, franks and sausages and burgers. That's going to be... The menu for tomorrow father's day barbecue i got everything like set up my uncle bought some things over that we can use yeah everything is packed up stacked up things are in the cooler um i have the charcoal I have things right here yeah sexy yeah sexy your girl has been working all day all day let me cover this stuff back up. All right, nice and tight. I just want to show my sexy food. But a lot of this stuff been cooled off, so I'm good to put it in the fridge. Are you on your way? Are you coming soon to me? I'm parking in the day. I'ma send an Uber to your place It's my secret safe Safe with just you and me We can't leave a trace This is my favorite
It is now 8.45 and I am done for the evening. And I'm just gonna pick the camera back up tomorrow, Sexy Crew, and show y'all the vibes. I'm gonna get cute with y'all tomorrow. And yeah, we're gonna head on over to the park and celebrate Father's Day together. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, Sexy Crew. I wasn't gonna talk to y'all until I was done in the shower and things of that nature. But I had to say something. I hope y'all can hear me with the shower running. Why no one told me about this? Why nobody told me about this near? If you tired of razor bumps, if you tired of shaving, you apply this. Baby soft, sexy, baby soft. Baby soft. I put it on my legs and everything. I'll be right back, I'll be right back. Hey sexy, I'm ready to go. It is Father's Day. Happy Father's Day to all the dads out there, all the amazing dads. I hope y'all have a blessed day. And sexy, your girl is ready, ready, ready. I showed y'all that little clip in the shower because I wanted to show y'all the near sexy. Like, real quick, real quick. I'm in a rush, but real quick. Y'all have to get this. The near body clean. Sexy. Like I said, I remember my mom using this when I was a youngin. And I didn't know it was so good. And it has, in this one, it has cocoa butter and vitamin E. I love the vibes. No shaving, sexy. No shaving. And while we over here, let me mention the scent of the day, which is this Killian. And I have on Princess and Love Don't Be Shy. So I mixed it. It's a combo going on, sexy. I'm smelling amazing. I'm so rushing, sexy, to get out of here. Um, Hamo and my boys, they're already downstairs. They bought everything downstairs. 
and I'm on my way downstairs so I can help my man put the things on the grill. You know, it is Father's Day, so I'm going to be on the side helping him with the grill, but I wanted to show you how to fit. So on my feet, I'm just going to put on my, my green and black ones, and I have on this green army fatigue skirt. It's too, too cute. I believe I got it from TMU months ago. I have on this bodysuit from Skims. And I'm just bringing this pretty green purse. And it's giving a dupe. It's giving a Chanel dupe. It's really, really cute. I crimp my hair. Regular accessories going on. Sexy. Earrings are also dupe. I did a little makeup look. Just a little light makeup look for the day. Got my bun going on. And your girl out. I'll show y'all the vibes when I get outside. We on the move, sexy. I still, I still had to pull something. Look, why I still had to pull something, sexy? But we on the move. We head into the park, and it's only ten in the morning, and the park is lit already. Let me show y'all. Park is lit. Good morning, Miss Shirley. Good and you.
Everybody, except my mother. Everybody, uh, yeah. everybody. Yeah. Hold on. I'm just saying, always was on deck. I called my cousin. I was like 18 years old. I'm moving back to Queensbridge by myself. I called my cousin. I'm like, yo, the shit pull the razor out on me. Put the razor out on me. Yeah, uh, why? I'm not, I'm not you. Tell him out. 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 Tell him he protected me from He protected me from Everybody love this guy right here y'all This is my nigga right here So this is um, dedication to 
Sexy crew see me? I'm shiny. But can y'all see me? <laughs> Sexy crew. Well, it just went dark on us. <laughs> Wait. Sexy crew. It's one o'clock in the morning. One o'clock in the morning. But I wanted to say goodnight to y'all. 
and I wanted to say I'll see y'all in the next vlog. I had to end my vlog. I'm ending my vlog. I just showered and moisturized my face. That's why I'm looking like a grease. We ain't gonna say that word. What? Look, I'm lit, sexy. I'm just gonna close the vlog out. And I'm going to see y'all in the next vlog. I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. If y'all have, please give your girl a big thumbs up. And I'm out. Y'all continue to be safe out there. Y'all continue to be sexy. Wait, did I say it right? <laughs> y'all continue to be safe out there. Y'all continue to smell good. And y'all, y'all stay sexy. Blessings.